News coming in right now. Mega Hanuman Jayanti vigil in Delhi. Massive security in Delhi's Jahangir Puri. Those pictures coming in from Jahangir Puri at the moment. As you can see, massive police force deployment has been put on the ground over there in order to ensure that everything is peaceful and passes off peacefully. You can see drones are being used as well to keep an eye on the proceedings on the ground. Hanuman Jayanti is being celebrated across the country today and already in certain areas, central forces have also been deployed as well, including in the state of West Bengal, which, for instance, witnessed violence around Ram Navami. Now, on the occasion of Hanuman Jayanti, the MHA has instructed all states to maintain law and order and as you can see over there, massive police deployment in Jahangir Puri in Delhi. My colleague Shreya Chatterjee is now joining us live from the, at the moment. Uh, Jahangir Puri, Shreya, is a very sensitive area and hence, of course, uh, the police taking no chances over there, especially after the MHA's diktat to ensure that law and order is not disturbed anywhere on the occasion of Hanuman Jayanti. Well, absolutely. So, you know, Pauli, me earlier to ensure that nothing actually uh, happens over here, the Delhi police had given a blanket uh, uh, note for any yatra to be carried out in Jangir Puri. That was on the 4th of April. However, there was a request that was given by the organizers, specifically the VHP. Followed by that, the Delhi police has revised their order and also said that they can only take out yatras in two distinctive portions of Jangir Puri, which is the H block and the E block. I am currently at C block. This is the flashpoint from where the yatra Yatra went violent last year. You can see the picture around me. This is nothing less than a lockdown currently that's underway here till 4 p.m. We spoke with some of the residents of C Block. They have very categorically told us that Delhi Police had a meeting with them and then requested them to ensure that the youth from the area do not venture out till 4 p.m. Now I'll just show you once that this is the lanes uh, leading to C Block. Locks have been put outside till 4 p.m. Uh, this will remain closed. And this entire area has been cordoned off. There is three layers of barricading specifically uh, around C block to ensure that even if the organizers do not pay heed to the orders by Delhi police, nothing untoward actually happened. There is presence of paramilitary four company, Delhi police security, drones, poor police has been deployed atop buildings as well. So that's every level of preparation there by Delhi police. We only hope that nothing untoward actually repeats like it was last year. Right. Uh, in terms of uh, the force uh, deployment, Shreya, can you give us more details? Well, absolutely. Uh, you know, Polymy, uh, there's four company of paramilitary that's been deployed. Uh, Delhi police has also been deployed. Local police, you see, have been stationed at these very places. There are right control vehicles that are also there. You can see the level of barricading. There's at least three layers of barricading. Uh, the DCP is currently on the ground. He's been carrying forward flag marches. I'll ask my cameraman to show you the other side of the barricading as well. So even if anyone really wants to move around this location, they really cannot because Delhi police is strictly ensured that the entire area is turned into a fort. This is something that I'm talking especially pertaining to C block because this is the very area where the clashes erupted last year. Now I'll also ask my cameraman to show you the visuals atop the buildings. You can see Delhi police personnel deployed at almost every building top to ensure that incidents like stone pelting uh, or such are really, uh, I mean, absolutely averted. And as I talk to you, Paulumi, you can see that the flag march that is right currently underway uh, in the lanes of Jangir Puri. This is proceeding again towards uh, C block. The DCP himself is also present uh, as the flag march is currently underway uh, in pockets of Jahangir Puri. Okay, Shreya there of course uh, giving us details and those live pictures of the flag march which is being conducted. The DCP himself is on the ground in Jahangir Puri right now. Those pictures of course of uh, the Union Home Minister as well who of course has taken stock of uh, the situation especially after the incidents that were reported, violent clashes uh, that were reported from certain parts of the country including West Bengal and Maharashtra in the 
run up to Ram Navmi and on the occasion of Ram Navmi, even later in West Bengal as well, strict instructions have gone out from the Ministry of Home Affairs to all states to maintain law and order in order to ensure that no untoward incident takes place on the occasion of Hanuman Jayanti. It is of course uh, sensitive on the ground in Jahangir Puri, Jahangir Puri which has uh, been the center of uh, flashpoints in the past. The police over there taking no chances on this occasion. You can see the force. At least four companies of paramilitary forces have been deployed as Shreya, my colleague, has been reporting on the ground and the DCP himself is on the ground in order to monitor the situation in real time.